this is your Media Mark Spring Outlook. This basically includes the rest of April, May, and beginning of June through the first part of the summer, just before the first day of summer. If we take a look at the country, you see we start to slip into that possible El Nino pattern. Now, however, I don't think the El Nino will be too strong until summer to latter portion of the summer into fall. You see across the portion of the United States here, temperatures will be a little bit below normal here in the northeast, a little bit above normal here in the southeast, and then of course out west here, slightly below normal in the southwest, slightly above normal in the northwest. Precipitation wise, we're gonna be dealing with a good portion of moisture here across the southwest and much of the west coast for that matter. Good portion of the west will be average higher than normal precipitation into the Intermountain West. Here across the Southern Plains, we'll deal with slightly above average into the, the Southeast as well. And we'll deal with slightly below average precipitation here across the Great Lakes into Northeast and portions of New England. Everywhere else we'll be looking at average for that point. And let's take a look at the storm track we'll be looking at for the most part of spring here. We'll be looking at the jet stream a little bit below uh, where it should be for spring traveling mainly across the Great Lakes Northeast those storm systems will drop out of Canada so even though we won't see above average or average precipitation slightly below average we'll have these quick moving systems that kind of remind you of late fall early winter and then you get those uh, spritzels of rain and you get a little bit of chilliness behind it however here out west we'll start off spring with the ridge but we'll slowly sink south a little bit as we get further closer to the possible El Nino that could be developing this summer. So that's what we're going to be looking at here and every point in between we want to look at a possibly busy severe weather season from the central plains on southward here. So we'll look for that possibility as some of these systems have the capabilities especially these stronger Pacific systems of developing some of this gulf moisture here and creating the clash of the air masses. So that's pretty much your spring update here from Media Mark. That's going to do it. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at Media Mark. Subscribe to me on YouTube at MediaMark.com.